we must always push the limits because if we never fail, we will never succeed. That's a nice one. My first good aquamarine. Check out that color. Check out that clarity, man. Hey, welcome back to another adventure. Miners, prospectors, and all you rock hounders. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you like what you see today and you decide to subscribe. I am on top of Mount Antero here in Colorado. We've been hiking for a good ways up. I'm out of breath. We're around probably 12 to 13,000 feet up. I'm at the Thank You Lord claim. This claim is known to produce some of the highest quality aquamarines known to Mount Antero. So with all that being said, I'm gonna get up here right behind me where is where i'm going to be working if you'd like to see more videos like this be sure and drop a thumbs up let's get this video up to about a thousand likes and i'll definitely come back we were just right over that hill as you can see the other guys are making their way up to the top okay made it up to the gathering site Notice all this rock is granite. That's where the aquamarines are formed in. So this is basically the matrix. And all this has been weathering down for years. So I'm gonna get up there, see if I can't find a pocket of aquamarines. Okay, it looks like I found my first aqua. Got some blue tint to it. Not bad. All right, I'm gonna keep on digging. May be in a good spot right here. A lot of granite that are busted up into small pieces, so that's good. Well, I'm over here in Joe's territory and I found this nice smoky quartz. You can see the facets on it pretty much on every side. Oop. But check that out. Facets all the way around. Nice. like Joe came up with a good one dark blue very nice looks like we got some sunshine for a little bit so that really helps increase the uh, visibility of the aquamarine really helps just like any gemstone Joe's tearing it up He's in the lead. Here's a really cool piece of barrel. minerals and rocks been over here digging with Brian and uh, Joe over here where I was and come out with the perfect not a perfect but so far the best check that out folks that's a nice one glad he found it all right, there's going to be more. Let's keep going. Yeah.
Looks like Joe found a nice little piece of quartz. A good facet. Check that out. Nice jewelry piece. my first specimen it's got an aquamarine in quartz check this out i was just picking around right here on the edge of the rock cliff and uh it popped out right there i flipped it over and it's got a nice aqua attached to it that's pretty cool looks like i'm in a good spot i'm gonna keep going piece is pretty cool it's got some bluish tint to it it's like it might have be part of a aquamarine vein good indicator all right been raking away over here and check this out this is my first good aquamarine check out that color check out that clarity man really light blue Check it out in the sun. Wow, that's so cool. Mount Antero. All right, I've been kind of skipping around, jumping around over here a little bit, and thought I'd come back over here where I was working. Had a little cave in from where Joe's at, and I believe it helped bring this one right here to surface check that one out that's a good one right there looks like i'm still in a pretty good spot i'm gonna keep going you get one? No, we'll, we'll check. looks like it's about a half inch by maybe three eighths sweet Wow. Now that's a true aquamarine. Long hike to the Jeep up in the trees. All right, working our way down the mountain. It's not easy. Got this rope here to hang on to to help get down. at what I found today. The background noise is the uh, Arkansas River, so sorry about that. Here is the really nice one that I came across. This just got some nice clarity. Oh man, that thing is so beautiful. And then we have this one here that was really blue. Check that out. 
Wow, that's so cool. These aqua marines are so beautiful. And next we have the specimen that I found. It has a aqua attached to quartz. Now that was really cool to find. Couldn't believe it. And I may soak that in iron out. You would not want to soak that in hydrochloric acid. Even the iron out could release it from the quartz. So I may just give it a good scrub with a brush and leave it like that. Have the smoky quartz. That's a good one right there. Came across. Some more pieces of the smoky quartz. And I'm not sure what this is here. Definitely quartzy or, you know, not sure. Here we go, a couple aquas for the collection. It's so awesome how those just glow. Okay, everybody, that's it from Mount Antero. Hope you enjoyed the video. You got to see some amazing pieces. It's just a matter of time. One of those five to six inch aquamarines are gonna pop out of that granite, ranging from up to, you know, $50,000. You never know. So I hope you all enjoyed it. I'll see you on the next video.